Welcome back live, VIPboxing.tv. I'm Simon Clayton, the Claymaker. We're in Claymaker's Corner. We're coming to you live from the Victoria Warehouse. We've got John Evans in attendance covering the show for Boxing News. We've got Tyson Fury, the madman. He's somewhere ringside, he's somewhere. Can't see him. If I'm honest, I'm probably avoiding him. We're gonna get him over though, we're gonna do an interview. We're gonna go mental. David Canade's in the ring. Yeah. Sending out an SOS. Tweet in, tell us where you're watching the fight. Are you watching it in your front room? Are you watching it in someone else's? Should you even be and there? And opposing him from Gorton, here comes Ryan Doyle. Yes! Dirty old town! Jamie Moore, Stephen Foster. Haha! <laughs> And Stu McCulloch. Uh, I like Ryan Doyle. Exciting fighter. Very exciting fighter. The fight with Ian Bailey last year was one of the fights of the year. Back in the ring now. Ladies and gentlemen, this contest, Love the t -shirt as well. I contest it looks number 11 is sponsored still proudly by 666 six, six Bet. Four three minute rounds of boxing in the super featherweight division. Introducing to you, firstly, boxing out of the blue corner, wearing the red colour shorts trimmed with white. At the weigh-in, he scaled nine stone, six pounds. He hails from Poland, presenting David Gennady. And opposing him, boxing out of the red corner, wearing the black colour shorts trimmed with gold and white. At the weigh-in, he scaled nine stone, seven pounds. His outstanding record this evening reads ten contests, nine wins. Five of those wins coming by way of knockout with just a single defeat. He hails from Gorton. Please welcome Ryan Ruthless Doyle. Timekeeper at the bell is Barry Pender from South Yorkshire. Referee in charge of the action, Mark Lyson from Liverpool. Four three minute rounds. It's the big fight, sponsored by 666bet.com. Welcome back live guys, VIP Boxing, Doyle V Canade. We're going to Cade's corner man, it's that kind of bloke that would tell you a dodgy second hand car. Ala Boise. Ah, there we go. Seconds out, round one. First round, Doyle, black trunks, gold trim. Canade. I'm sure it's, I'm sure it's a silent K whenever you, when you see anything like that, but I'm not going to doubt the great man Michael Pass. Doyle, southpaw there, back orthodox. He's winning his fight against Bailey. A number of things happened in the fight. You won't hear Doyle making them excuses, but you speak to him about the fight. There was a lot of contributing factors. All he does is give Bailey credit, he wants to do it again. Trained hard for this fight. Back in the gym, he was in the gym all over Christmas as well. Nice tidy fight and he's exciting. Nice jab from Doyle. Lovely right hand as well there from Doyle backing up off the back of his double jab. Landing the jab again there, Doyle backing him up. Need sitting on the ropes, just working his way around. He's coming off the ropes now into centre ring. Oh, 
Well, that right hand only just missed. Not going to be wrong, that punch was in yesterday's Manchester Evening News. Paul Edwards has tweeted me and Edwards Eddie. Cracking picture of him and his little lad watching the boxing. Another very, very popular former pro was Paul Edwards. See him at all the Liverpool shows, see him around the scene. Goes to the weigh-in. Always looks like he's up to summit. Always looks like he's just let the car, the tyres down on your car. Hope you're well, Paul. Speak to you soon, mate. Probably see it away in. But a blood now coming from Doyle's nose. Sorry, from Nade's nose. Doyle's been accurate with a lot of his work. He's set a good pace. Head's gone back there from Nade. Cheeky sod nearly put blood on my iPad then. And there, Doyle. Boxed at range well, good round for him there. There we go, bit of ring card girl action. Round number two. Edwards Eddie, cover your lad, cover your little lad's eyes up, mate. Don't want to be looking at them. his 10th fight one nine just the one defeat to Bailey he's had five stoppages got him out of there five times likes boxing in Manchester corners 10 seconds second round coming up seconds out round two dodgy second hand car salesman's done a good job there with Canade's face it's back in Stem the blood flow. Doyle straight back on him. The jab again there from Doyle, backing him up. Doubles the jab up. Plenty of head movement from Doyle as well. Sat on the jab, player and met one another. Lovely right hand from Doyle straight down the middle. Nice right hand to the body as well. And another one. That straight right hand down the middle. I fancy that's going to be the shot from Doyle. Nice little body shot, slip the head shot well there from Doyle. Nice jab. Beautiful jab. Nose has gone again. You watch Canade now, he's just, when he's covering up, he's covering up for that, that second longer. Put his head down there, there's plenty of claret showing. This fight might be in Manchester, but we talk Cockney, we, we talk boxing. Lovely speed shots there from Doyle, doubling up body and head. Oh, nice left hand straight down the middle. Has that right hand again? I'm going to call it the Manchester Evening News shot. If it lands, it's in tomorrow's paper. When it misses, it looks like it was thrown in yesterday's. Nice shot from Doyle again. Put them together again. Now. He's enjoying himself in there. There's not a lot coming back from Canade. I don't know if the referee will have a look at it. Hunting him down now, doing lovely left uppercut there. I'd like to see him cutting the ring off now as well. Keep him in there. Uppercuts he's crying out for. Body shorts, he's banging him in. I'm not sure how much more of this Canade's going to want to take. That was the shot. It's only a short little uppercut just underneath the ribs. Face is a right mess there it is. 
Doyle banging in the body shots now. Nice combination, fast stance from Doyle. Putting them together, nice right hand as well. Referee's having a look at it. Left hand as well. Doyle takes a step back so he can pick his shots. Lovely jab and right hand and uppercut as well. Good action there, the referee's having a look at this. Let's have a little look, let's catch up on the tweets. Tom Farrell's tweeted in, indirectly. Another nice boxer there. Beautiful city of, beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Beautiful city of Liverpool. Keep the tweets coming in guys, hashtag VIP Boxing Live. Half past ten this fight, another four to go. I'll be home for one o'clock. Via Peter Pans in Lee. They've not paid me for this plug, however, I'm going to plug their Donna Kebabs. Corners, ten seconds. Please don't tweet in and tell me what's in a Donna Kebab. Someone did that to me little sister years ago. She's never Set ate another out. chicken nugget. Round three. Why would you tell a kid at primary school what's in chicken nuggets? Back in the ring, round three. I think Doyle will get him out of there in this round. And then the way throw, throwing them shots, he's certainly going to look at getting him out of there. Real intent on the shots now. What I do like about Doyle is his shot selection when he gets them on the ropes, when he's moving round. He picks his shots, he lands his shots. So many times you see a boxer, you, you, talk, you talk about great finishers. That's when you get an opponent hurt, you get them on the ropes and you've got the ability to get them out of there. I don't think Doyle's had him act actually on the brink of getting him out of there yet. He's stung him, he's hurt him a couple of times. Referee's having a look, he's having a look most books because of the amount of claret that was coming in the last round as well. Doyle doesn't want to get reckless here. He's had two good rounds, he's having a good comeback performance. Nice jab from Doyle. Landed straight on the button. There's that right hand again. Nice shot. See Doyle away, he steps in. Halfway through the third round, off four. Two completed, both to Doyle. Took a little elbow there, did Canade accidentally from Doyle. Nice right hand back from him. That's the first punch he's landed in about four minutes. That jab again there from Canade. Sorry that Canade took. Legs went a little bit there from Canade, but he picked up on that. He's keeping him pinned in that corner now. He's banging the body shots in. Lovely shot there from Doyle, the left hand was. A lovely right uppercut, that's her team. One, Beautiful two, shot selection again three, from Doyle. Four, Beautiful five, uppercut, called it right six, on the front. Referee's going to wave this off. Eight. It's all over. Ryan Doyle's back with a win. Ruthless Ryan Doyle. Moves to ten wins. Six KOs. The one defeat. That was a good performance from Doyle. It was good shot selection. I promise you blood, sweat and tears, he says it on the t-shirt, he's like Ron Seal, he says and does exactly what he says on the tin. Four fights to go, this is a breeze, I could do 25 fights, but I don't want to. Still to come we've got Sam Hyde, Andy Cole. Ladies and gentlemen, after two minutes. 24 seconds of round number three. Referee Mark Lyson has stopped the contest in his opinion. David Gennady was in no position to continue. Therefore, your winner hailing from marvellous Gorton Ryan, Ruthless Doyle.
your appreciation please for our continental visitor, David Canada. We're back after these short messages. Stay.